Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 56 of New Vegas. Alright, when we left off, we had actually, uh, I had actually just scoured the place a bit. Uh, after a very, very intense run-in with some Cazadors. Um, and I found a key to this door here, right over here. So, I guess we're gonna go in and find out what's down here. Wow. Wow kind of expansive. Well, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, that's something I can use. Strategic nuclear moose and God said let them have beer. That's a, uh, that's a thing. That's definitely a thing. Hey, big book of science. And another key. I'll read the big book of science, because that always helps. Brings it up by three, hell yeah. Uh, beer, we could use that for Cook Cook's recipe, but we're... They also have to have more stats and survival for that. As I just found out a little earlier. Just a little bit. Just a little bit higher. So no, no worries, we're pretty much good. Bunch of BBs. Why did he think a BB gun would be able to protect him? Okay, let's... Whoop. This way. There we go. That's what's opened. That's what would open it. And there is a lot of explosives here. Plasma mine. Pulse mine. Holy crap. I can sell all that. That'd be really good. A bunch of suitcases. Uh, can use the key. Oh! This is why. Okay, cool. Uh, missile launcher. That actually sells for pretty good, but it weighs a lot. Um, take all that and this. Um, uh, that weighs a ton. Okay, uh, that and that. That'll be good. And I'm pretty sure I can repair something. This I definitely need to repair. I took a lot of damage from those castors. Uh, yeah, we'll use this. Um, hmm. There's gotta be something I can repair. Um. Hmm. Lever action. The lever action or lever action? I don't know. Uh, pair that with that, because the... Caravan shotguns usually don't... Uh, way much is what I was going to say, but, uh, value m for much is what I meant to say. Oh, I could have repaired this with the laser rifle. God damn it. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> oh, well. I'll eat one of these. Bring up my stats a little bit. Okay. It's an iron. It's a box. Bunch of boxes. Yeah, that's, that is really weird. I did not expect to see this. Well, okay. So, uh, it seems that while this guy was doing his little bootlegging, a nest of Casadors kind of sprung up behind his house. And then when he tried to come outside, they uh, killed his ass dead. Very quickly. Apparently. Yeah, that, that's the way it goes. If you're not paying attention, you're going to die <laughs> out here. That's how it goes. So, we have to go further north to head to Vault 22. Which makes sense. So I didn't think we were that close when we got here. Oh, let's go over here. Climbing rocks is not the way to get up there, I think. Although it would keep us down... Uh, away from the craziness down below over there. Fuck, there's another Casador. Go the hell away. God damn it. Motherfucker, why didn't I come up here? Fucking fuck a duck. Here, take this. God damn it. Go crazy on your other... P fucking... God 
Go away! Anti-venom, there we go. Head north. We'll keep heading north. God damn it. Go the hell away! Okay, uh... Uh, we'll knock off the antenna in this one. There, that one will start fighting the other guys. And that should give me a little bit of a distraction. And let's take the antennae off this one. That did not work at all. Uh, let's aim for the body. Let's try and kill this one. God damn it. Motherfucker, go away from me. <laughs> Jesus. And eventually, this one will be dead now, I think. Alright. I don't know why I thought going further up would be good. If anything, I would just fuck me further. And he is falling. And I am dying slowly from this poison. Okay, well, at least the uh, other ones are off my tail. That's good, at least. And there's Vault 22. <laughs> I should really remove that poison. Uh, let's have a gecko steak for the time being. God damn it, there I go again. <laughs> and a purified water. And a couple stim packs. That should do me. Should do me some good. Yeah, I think that's a, that place, that whole upper spot is a no-no to go through. I think that's pretty close to the big empty. I think. How did the rest of them fare? I'm just curious how many of them survived. I'm just gonna see if I can take the antenna off that one. Yep. And sounds like someone's racing along our road there. Reload a little bit. Oh, well, that one's fighting that one. And we'll see if we can get this one. To... Nope, I can't even aim for the antenna on that one. That one's stuck where it is. Cazador egg. Poison gland is the most valuable part on it. Yep, there we go. Yeah, we'll take all of this. Oh, I'm overweight. Right now. Oh, shit. I uh, didn't even realize. Now let's have another Brahmin steak, eh? I kind of need the health. There we go. Yep. This, uh... This went in a completely different direction than I expected it would. Oh, there you are. Now you pop back out. And there you go. Alright, they didn't have nothing so far. Okay, now we'll head to Vault 22 as intended. <laughs> I just wanted to see if I could loot any of the last stuff on them. And I did, so we're good. We'll unlock Vault 22, and then we'll sell some of the stuff we collected. Because, goddamn, <laughs> it's a lot. A lot more than I definitely expected to be carrying. Damn, look at all that green. He was not kidding. It is a lush little spot. Damn. Stay out. The plants kill. Oh. 
Okay then. I guess that was written by the vault inhabitants when they left. That's a lot of mantises. Whoa, the frame rate dropped. Whoa, it went down fast. Okay. Don't know what's going on here. Uh, let's aim at the other one. There we go. Okay. There's that. And there's another one. Nope, I cannot hit that one. It is too covered in foliage. Jeez, it is high amounts of foliage that makes this whole th frame rate thing to go to hell. Jeez. There's really nothing I can use off these mantises, so we'll ignore them for right now. I wonder if this place has any K fungus when I go in. Probably not. Probably will not have anything of the sort. Um, hmm. That's a lot of stuff. Oh, duffel bag. I'll take those rounds. The wrench. Yeah, we'll collect a few things while we're here. Oh, I'll take that. That's a restored terminal. Vault 22 Expedition Entry 1. I've established a temporary camp inside the entrance of the vault. Power inside is minimal, but still running, and I've managed to back into one of their security terminals. The logs show that several people have entered the vault over the past few months, but none have left. It's getting late, so I'll resume the expedition in the morning. Keely out. Oh, so this must be Keely. Okay. The growth in the interior matches the exterior to a T. It's a little surprising given the scarcity of sunlight in the entrance room. But even more surprising is that they seem to originate from further below. Maybe that fool Hildern was onto something after all. Since my pit boy is on the fritz, I'll try to keep a running log of my discoveries in whatever computers I can find and collate the data before leaving. So she has a pit boy as well. Okay. Well, we know a little bit of what's going on here. Now we'll go ahead out and drop off some of the stuff we carried all the way here. I think we'll just go to Gunrunners again. Because I can always pick up good stuff there. And that's always good, right? Picking up good weapons and whatnot. Well, it keeps you alive out here, so you might as well. Alright. And the Brahmin steak wore off when I got here. Yeah, it happens. Welcome, sir so, or madam. Do you wish to purchase, purchase something? something? Ah, I'm just bored with practicing voices. There we go. And yeah, let's see what we can drop, which is a lot of Cazador poison. Nope. Yep, we can drop that too. Cazador poisoned land. That is a shit ton. And that's a lot of money for him. Look at that. Whew. I'll drop some of these. The empty syringes I can make more stim packs with. Drop all these. Hmm. A lever action shotgun. We are going to exhaust the un amount of caps this thing can give us. Ugh, excuse me. Boom. It's been one of those days. I'm just a little burpy. Okay, and there should be something else. I'm pretty sure. Yes! Tri-beam laser rifle. And I think that's about everything. Yes, I will come back and see you again soon. How much am I carrying now? Uh, 255. That gives me 40 pounds extra leeway, and I can use the Brahmin stakes and buff outs whenever I need more strength. Okay. Cool. Cool. That is good. And let's look at my stats now. Food and water are decent. Sleep's not really 
become a factor since the DLC. That's weird. Normally that's supposed to be something. Hmm. Maybe I need to sleep into a nearby bed and it resets it. I don't know. Let's just see how fast this katana can go. Woo, 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 woo. Okay. I'm done. Okay, let's head back to Vault 22. <laughs> I did my drop-off. I think we should be good. For now, anyway. Oh. Frame rate dropped a little bit as it was loading stuff in. And there we go. And we will go further in. I love this gun basically because it stays lit up, even the darkest spots. It is really cool. Uh, this is an elevator. I can repair the elevator. Cool. Um, we're just going to go by the stairs for right now. That way we have a decent idea of good progress to be making and linear progress all right oxygen recycling and of course there's also some spots where the elevator is blocked off from so it would not be behoove us to go through that route anyway Open that door. whoa okay Turn on my pit boy light. Give me a little extra sight. Hmm. Oh, would you look at that? Bunch of plans. Oh, this is a terminal. Entry three, four, and five. So we're already on the right track. This level seems to be seems to have been devoted to the study of atmospheric effects on plants with a concentration on producing plants with a high oxygen yield. Given the problems these vaults were known to have, it sounds like a reasonable avenue of research. Entry 4. It's strange, but some sections of the machinery down here appear to have been modified for some unknown purpose. The restraints regarding oxygen content and systemic pressure have been bypassed. That doesn't sound like it's a good thing. I've been hearing a strange chittering sound for some time now, and finally discovered its source. There's some kind of giant mantises that have taken up residence in the vault. I almost ran smack into one the other day, but creatures but the creatures don't appear to react to my presence at all. Perhaps the others sent here ran afoul of the creatures, but I can't see how a few scattered insects could pose much of a problem to experienced mercs. Well, that might not be the only thing down here, Keeley. I remember seeing a few crazy little motherfuckers. Whoop, that's my computer saying my editing's done. Whoa! They went running. Activate this terminal. Uh, check inventory. And it doesn't really do anything, so there's really no point to check inventory. Okay. Give me just a moment, I'm gonna swap back to, uh, my recording software. Uh, I was editing an episode in the background, I didn't expect it to be finished so quickly. <laughs> okay. I know the decent route we're supposed to be going. That's another computer. This is probably a restored one. Yep. Noise complaint. Could maintenance look into the duct work here on level 2 again? I know you guys took a look at this last week, but I swear the noise is back. I even have other people that can back me up on it this time, too. So, there was something in the ducts, and when they had bypassed everything, that allowed it to grow and spread. That is concerning. That's not something you should be doing in a vault where people are supposed to be living in. Then again, I know Vault Tech was a uh, bit shady in some of this. Trying to uh, do social experiments and whatnot inside these vaults. Alright. Well, 
I did a full loop around the whole facility. So, I know that. It's all good. That's the stairs I came from. That's the elevator. And that's the stairs further down. Whoop! <laughs> I ran smack into a wall. Bam! Dumb me. Food production. With... Oh, I was about to read that. Didn't realize this thing loads so quickly. And... I'm sure I'm gonna need a little more perception on this. So I'm gonna pop on my uh, park ranger hat. For right now. Gives me a little added perception. Uh, what? Um... Um... How did I not see you? Spore carrier. Yeah, this is... Yeah, this corroborates what I saw in Zion. Fuck. I will end the episode here for now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. And we can talk about the games we're currently playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat. Playing games for you.